Hi Scorpio, welcome back to Just Dream Guide. Okay, so this is your situation, action, outcome for January 1st through 7th this week. And then I'm going to pull an oracle card and then I'm going to pull a couple cards to show you about your love life this week. Okay, so situation, action, outcome for Scorpio this week. We got one. What is your action? Two. And what is your outcome, Scorpio, for this week? What is Scorpio's outcome closet for this week? Oh, there we go. Okay. We got the Ten of Cups is your situation. You have a happy home life, happy family life. Things are going great for you this week. Scorpio, as far as the family is going, everything's going to go swell this week, okay? The actionable items to still take care of yourself. There might be a, a reunion, a reconciliation between somebody, okay? So just looking at that, you're like, oh, okay. Your action might be to, to choose this person or not choose this person. It's up to you. Sometimes that means also choosing yourself, looking in the mirror and saying, okay, I'd rather be with myself. That's your action. Your outcome is the Four of Cups. For some reason, even though you have this happiness here, you're discontent with life. Probably in your love life. I'm getting that Scorpio, your love life isn't going as you want it to go. It's not that it's not going as planned. It's just not like what you want it to go. Like Because the angels are telling me that it's going like it's supposed to. However, you're like, mm, nah. you don't really, I don't know if this person is coming back or if you want to be with them or if they, they really want to be with you, though. So, your hidden energy is the King of Pentacles. You having the Midas touch this week, okay, even when it comes to your finances. So, your finances, you're focused on. You rather focus on your finances and, you know, um, entrepreneurial opportunities rather than focus on relationships so that's probably what's taking you away from a uh, reconciliation or some kind of resurgence of a relationship let's get an oracle card for you scorpio let's see what's going on for you scorpio father give me one oracle card for scorpio here we go Repairing the veil, forgiveness. Okay, so somebody is probably going to come back this week, Scorpio. 45, so that's 9. 9 might be a significant number this week. But they they want to offer you like a new stage of something. And, you know, it's saying forgiveness, repairing the veil, repairing the connection between somebody or something. Also, I'm hearing self-forgiveness, forgiving yourself for whatever happened in the past. I don't feel like you're doing that enough this week. So remember that. For forgive yourself. Forgiveness is very important this week. Give me two cards for the love life of Scorpio this week. Uh, the two cards for the love life of Scorpio this week. There's one. There's two. Patience and finances. So that's why you're focusing on your money. You're like, uh uh, I don't want to focus on this relationship. I'd rather focus on my money. Sorry, I'm sorry to laugh, but it says patience. You know, everything will unfold in divine timing, okay? And financial challenges are affecting this relationship, this connection. So that's why you're focusing on your king of pentacles your money your entrepreneurship because you're kind of over this whatever this person is whoever this person is you're kind of over love right now and you're focusing on your money because you're probably having financial challenges but you're happy you're still happy you know but you're like no this person probably caused you to be broke at some point or like some kind of way took you away from like being building your business how you want to build it anyways the two cups is your actionable item you know either reconciliation with yourself you know, finding yourself in love or accepting an offer of love from someone else. So that's your action this week. Thank you for watching, Scorpio. If this resonated with you, go to my website, juststreamguide.com, book a reading. Thank you, thank you, thank you for your time. As always, see you next time.